Hello, hope you're doing good. Welcome to my PHOA walkthrough and tutorial. PHOA is an all-in-one HOA software that is designed for landlords and homeowners. With PHOA, you can get started for completely free. And they also offer numerous features. For example, you can use it to set up accounting, you can use it to monitor your budgets and reports, you can also use it for invoicing, and also the monitoring of your income when it comes on to being a landlord if you have numerous properties. To get started, you're going to go on to payhoa.com and then from there, you can tap on start your 30-day free trial period. You don't need a credit card or anything like that to sign up. Once you have signed up, you will be redirected to a dashboard just like this. On this dashboard, you'll now be able to add your units and owners so you can tap right here where you see add units and owners then you could tap on add first property after doing that you could input the title of the unit then you could put in the address right there after adding in the address you can also add an image if you want right there so for example i'll just put in a test address so let's do that real quick then we'll just put up a random image so i'll select upload an image and I'm just going to put up a random image. Let's say for example sake, I were to put up this thumbnail for example sake. So I'll put up that. Then you'll simply scroll down and from there you can tap on create a new unit. After selecting create a new unit, you will be redirected to this page. And you can see it right there how it looks. So I've created my first unit. After doing that, you can go over to the left hand menu option once more and you could tap on dashboard. After selecting dashboard, you can create an invoice if you want by tapping on create an invoice. Then from there, you could select the unit that you had created. After selecting the unit, you from there you will see the option save selected unit. After creating the unit, if we were to go over to the top left hand corner and tap on launchpad, from there you can connect your bank account so you could tap on connect bank account and then you could tap on add bank account and you can add your banking information. So that's how you'll be able to set up your billing. You can also scroll down and from there you can invoice homeowners. So you could tap right there where you see home invoice. Then from there you could tap on add invoice or you can tap on send sample invoice. So you could tap right there and you could send sample invoice as you can see right there or you can choose to add an invoice. So you have numerous options that you can select from. After doing that, I would recommend that you go back over to Launchpad and from there you can upload your organization logo and then we can continue browsing the different features. So for example, if we were to select units, you can see the unit that we have added and you can tap on add units in the top right hand corner to add more units. By tapping on people from the left hand menu option, from here you'll only see your name and email address at the moment. But if you like to add more persons, you can tap on add owners in the top right hand corner and you could do that. You can also use this platform to create invoices. So you could select invoice right there from the left hand menu option and you could create that. You can also tap on payables from the left hand menu option. And after tapping on payables, you can see right here with this section, you'll be able to manage vendors and streamline your account payable. And this will allow you to take control of your association's payables with, with their comprehensive HOA management software. And you'll be able to streamline the entire process by accepting vendor invoices via email to be automatically scanned and upload into PHOA. Then use workflows to request and automate approvals and set up online payments to vendors to complete the task. If you would like to use it, you can tap on enroll now. You can see that it costs $19 per month. So you can use that feature if you want. And by going over to the left hand menu option once more, you could select vendors and then from there you can add new vendors. And you'll be able to monitor your transactions by tapping on transactions. And this would happen after you have added your bank account. You can add in income and you can also add in expenses. And to view your budget, you'll tap on budgets from the left hand menu option. 
and then from here you can set up your budget as you can see right here so you could tap on manage fy and you could set up your budget you can also view your reports by selecting reports from there you'll be able to view your balance sheet and so on and that's basically it there are other tools if you were to tap on other tools you can see them right there by tapping on other tools in the bottom left hand corner you will be able to create surveys so you can create multiple choice surveys right here you can also scroll down and you'll be able to send past due emails so you can send that right there you can also use this platform to build a website if you want so you could tap on website builder you can also use their message board feature and you can also use their form 1099s you can use their tax form for vendors and contractors if you want and that's it hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative this was just basically a walkthrough of the PHOA platform if you think that this is a good choice for you you can also use it and give it a 30 day trial period and see if you like it if not you can move on to a different platform hope you found this tutorial helpful and if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe